Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how I fix the problem with 30 FPS limit imposed by the game, as well as a slow motion bug that I started encountering a couple of days ago. Just as a note, I didn't have this problem from the beginning. At start, the game ran with 50-60 FPS, not too good, but playable. Then 3-4 days after the game's release, I launched one day the game and it was basically unplayable. I tried all the different things that people mentioned on the internet like uh, Nvidia control panel settings changes and sound settings in game to be changed to uh, 7.1 slash 5.1 from stereo. I also reinstalled the game but nothing helped. Then I wanted to uninstall Wild Hearts since it's unplayable but I've noticed that uh, someone mentioned antivirus to be potential culprit, especially uh, Bitdefender which I have installed on my computer. Uh, for reference, I have Ryzen 7 5800X with RTX uh, 3070 uh, with 32 GB RAM and the game installed on the SSD drive. So what helped me fix the problem was disabling advanced threat defense in my Bitdefender and also turning off EA app overlay, which bumped my FPS quite a bit. So here's how to do that. First, the bit defender. You click show, then you go to protection, advanced threat defense, settings, and you disable advanced threat defense. Alternatively, you can add the game's folder to exceptions in manage exceptions tab. I unfortunately couldn't add exception to the advanced threat defense part in bit defender. It only allowed me to do so for antivirus part of the protection. So I ended up disabling advanced threat defense before I launch Wild Hearts. But this problem might not be only related to Bitdefender. If you have other antivirus, then try playing with settings available for you. Perhaps your antivirus is conflicting with the game and limits Wild Hearts performance. Now let me show you how to disable EA overlay. Doing so improved my FPS a bit and who knows? might be the reason for slow-mo on your machine. So you go to your EA app, next to settings, then to application tab, and here you disable in-game overlay. I also disabled limit of FPS in NVIDIA control panel to see how the game performs now with antivirus disabled and EA overlay off as well, and sometimes the game spikes even to 80 FPS. It was way worse before. You know, it's unbelievable how inconsistent the Wild Hearts experience is. I think I have never experienced bigger optimization roulette than with this game. It's a damn shame, cause gameplay is fun as hell, else people wouldn't be trying so hard to solve the performance problems that they encounter. That's all for this video. Did it work for you guys? If you have another solution for this particular problem, and let us know in the comments down below. Perhaps you will help someone resolve this issue on their machine. And who knows, maybe they will help you in your hunts. Take care guys, happy hunting. 